Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to make this beautiful flower pattern. This pattern can be used as a mini placemat, doily, pot holder, cup coaster or even as a mud mat. I am going to use yarn of two colors for this project and a hook of 2.5 mm. So we are going to begin with slip knot. Now chain 1, 2, 3. We have to go back to the fourth chain, insert the hook in, yarn over, pull through both the loop. This is slip stitch. Chain 1, 2, 3, which counts as a double crochet, yarn over, insert the hook into the ring, pull through, pull through 2, pull through 2, double crochet 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine. We have to join these stitches on the top of the fourth stitch with slip stitch. The fourth round is complete. On the top of the fourth stitch, chain three, which counts as a double crochet into the same stitch, double crochet two. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, into the same stitch, double crochet 2. So complete the round by doing 2 double crochet on the top of each stitch across the round and we will meet again when this round would be complete. When this round is complete, we have to join the stitches on the top of the 4th stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the 4th stitch, chain 1, 2, 3, which counts as a double crochet into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, on the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1 so in this round we have to do two double crochet on the top of a stitch one double crochet on the top of the next two double crochet on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to join the stitches on the top of the fourth stitch with slip stitch now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add yarn of color B to the pattern. So we are going to begin with slip knot. Now we have to join the yarn on the top of the fourth stitch with slip stitch. Chain 1, 2, 3 which counts as a double crochet into the same stitch double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, double crochet 1 on the top of the next stitch. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1 into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, double crochet 1 on the top of the next stitch. So in this round, we have to do 2 double crochet on the top of a stitch. 1 double crochet on the top of the next, 1 double crochet on the top of the next stitch, 2 double crochet on the top of the next stitch, 1 double crochet on the top of the next and 1 double crochet on the top of the next stitch. Complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed. When this round is complete, we have to join the stitches on the top of the 4th stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the 4th stitch, chain 2 which counts as a half double crochet on the top of the next stitch half double crochet 2 yarn over on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 double crochet 1 on the top of the next stitch into the same stitch double crochet 2 
on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one yarn over on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch half double crochet two double crochet one into the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one half double crochet on the top of the next stitch so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now on the top of the four stitch chain two on the top of the next stitch half double crochet two on the top of the next stitch half double crochet three yarn over on the top of the next stitch double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one yarn over on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch half double crochet two on the top of the next stitch half double crochet three on the top of the next stitch half double crochet four double crochet one on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch half double crochet two so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed after the end of the round we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch chain one which counts as a single crochet on the top of the next stitch single crochet two single crochet three on the top of the next stitch yarn over on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch single crochet one single crochet two now for the second petal single crochet one single crochet two on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch single crochet one single crochet two so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now chain one which counts as a single crochet yarn over on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the same stitch double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet one on the top of the next stitch into the same stitch double crochet two 
on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch on the top of the next stitch half double crochet one single crochet on the top of the next stitch for the second petal single crochet one half double crochet one double crochet one on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch half double crochet on the top of the next stitch single crochet one on the top of the next stitch so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this flower would be completed this pattern is going to appear like this when it will be completed this pattern looks beautiful if you are going to make these cup coasters or the mug mats in as many colors as you wish or you can make these placemats or the mini placemats in a color as well this can be a very good gifting option too thank you so much